Hey everybody, this is Modern Refugee. Um, I was having a conversation with somebody recently and this topic came up and I said to myself, you know what, this is going to make a uh, good video. This, uh, like most of my videos, they revolve around uh, simplicity and uh, this is one of those simple things that uh, I think we've all uh, paid a little attention to no matter who you are in the last uh, couple of years and that revolves around this stuff right here toilet paper and uh, toilet roll to my friends in uh, Canada and Europe anyway um, toilet paper was a big thing back in March of 2020 it sold out and people couldn't find it but um, I'm gonna share my uh, thought on uh why that happened and uh, a majority of Americans um, haven't wiped their ass with anything but toilet paper and uh, us folks that have spent time camping and out in the woods and stuff um, have had to improvise that many times I mean I can remember back uh, to the old outhouses on the farms with the uh, Sears catalog in uh, the outhouses and uh, it was a thing let me let me tell you and uh, Kind of went away when I was a, a teenager, basically. But when I was like 8, 9, 10 years old, there was lots of times where we were at somebody else's farm where I had to go use the outhouse because there was no indoor plumbing in those uh, farms. And uh, that gets to uh, spend a little time in the woods. You know, if you spent more than just one night out in uh, the woods, if you spent, you know, three or four days out hunting or camping or something in an austere environment, you're going to learn real quick what you need and what you don't need. Um, and a lot of the stuff that people uh, carry and talk about, they don't really need, but there's some things that they do need, like, you know, some alternative to uh, toilet paper. And uh, in my packs, I carry... I carry wipes. In fact, this is the pack that I pull, or pack of wipes that I pulled out of my pack that uh, I've been uh, using this uh, summer here. And then other things are, you know, things like this in a more uh, communal environment to hold uh, toilet paper, keep uh, keep it out of the elements because toilet paper does not handle being wet very well. Um, I know guys that do carry toilet paper in Ziploc bags in their packs, but I don't. I prefer the wipes just because they're more uh, resilient because if this gets wet out in the middle of nowhere, you're going to be looking for alternatives. And that gets to the point of this video is alternatives to um, toilet paper. And again, this is the alternative right here. And uh, what it is is it's just a Mountain Dew bottle or any soda bottle that you took the cap, you can see it there, and uh, drilled a few holes in. And basically what this is now is this is a bidet bottle. And uh, you can make a few of these ahead of time if you got a drill. And these, of course, are everywhere. You don't have to you know, look too hard to find some of these. And even if things were really bad, I'm sure you could find a couple of these to make yourself one of these. I just keep uh, a few of these around. When I got a minute, I uh, take my drill and I buzz a few holes in the cap here. And this makes a little, little spray bottle, basically. And... Uh, Ideally, you'd want two of these. You'd want one with a little bit of water in, and uh, you want another one with a little bit of water, maybe a drop of soap in. That way you could clean yourself off and then rinse yourself off. And if uh, you know this isn't high-tech enough for you, you can also go with something like this. This will do basically the same thing. And a couple of these, again, is only a dollar or two, and you can throw it in if you don't, if you carry, you know, keep extra toilet paper or extra uh, um wipes around just uh buy a couple of these and throw them in just for worst case scenario or you know if you're going out in uh the bush or whatever um you can have some viable uh alternative to toilet paper because like i said toilet paper takes up a lot of room takes up a lot of space it's uh, not very hardy it's definitely not good for on the trail or whatever but uh those spray bottles you can find spray bottles. You can find bottles with, uh, you know, squirt pull tops on. You can kind of find that all over the place. Even if you uh, have to dumpster dive a little bit, you can still find these type of resources because there's this kind of stuff all over the place. But anyway, I just wanted to share that with you guys. Um, just give you a little bit of an alternative. If you don't have toilet paper or wipes, you can, uh, if you're a little bit resourceful, you can make yourself a uh, bidet bottle to uh, wash your uh, 
wash your backside and uh, keep sanitation going because sanitation, if something goes bad, is a thing. It can make you really, really sick. So it's best to have that squared away and have plans in place ahead of time or at least the idea of it. And that's what this video is, to, just to plant the seed of that idea in you guys' minds. But anyway, it's Modern Refugee. Appreciate all my subscribers out there. Hope you guys got a little information, a little entertainment out of this video here. And uh, you guys take care.